There are four signs on the main pole that indicate directions, south, north, west, east. Use the compass to place the main pole correctly so that the tracker can track the sun properly. The main pole must be installed on solid concrete ground or pier with the expansion bolts. The solid ground base must be larger or equal to a 600 by 600 by 70 millimeters cube. Take out the 516 x M12 x 55 mm hex socket cap bolt and M12 flange nut from the screw bag too and install them on the B-Rod. First, install the B-Rod on the main pole and then fix it with bolts and nuts. Take out two 10 x M8 x 40 mm hex socket shoulder screw and two M8 flange nut from screw bag 3. Then install the C-Rod onto the B-Rod and secure it with screw nuts. Take out 4 M8 x 80 mm hex socket cap bolt, 4 M8 flange nut, 4 M8 elastic washer, and 4 Phi 8 times 16 times 1 mm flat washer from screw pocket 4. Then place the D-rod on the B-rod and secure it with the part just taken out. Take out two E-rods and place them on the C-rod. Then take out 8M8 X 80mm hex socket cap bolt, 8M8 flange nut, 8M8 elastic washers, and 8 Phi 8 by 16 X 1mm flat washers from screw pocket 5 to install and fix them from top to bottom. Take out 6M8 X 25mm hex socket cap bolt from screw bag 7 and use them to install two silver linear actuator stand and a white linear actuator stand. Fix the manual rod rack to the main pole using two M8 times 25 mm hex socket cap bolt. Connect the B-Rod and manual rod with an M6 times 35 mm latch. Fix the manual rod to the manual rod rack using a Phi 8 times M6 times 30 mm hex socket shoulder screw, two Phi 8 times 24 times 2 mm flat washer and an M6 flange nut. Take out two M6 times 35 mm latch and R type cotter pin from screw bag 8 and install a 300 mm linear actuator. Take out 4, 41 times 21 times 1.5 mm, dash 11 50 mm channel steel, place them on the E-Rod, and connect them with two U-shaped connectors and two steel connectors. Take out 4 M6 X 30 X 50 mm square U-bolts, 8 M10 X 30 mm hexagonal socket cap bolts, 8 M10 flange nuts, and 6 M6 flange nuts to fix the channel steel to the E-Rod. Take out 3M5 x 10 mm hex socket cap bolt, 2M8 x 25 mm hex socket cap bolt, and 2M8 flange nut. Then install the sunlight sensor rack onto the channel steel, and after installation, install the sunlight sensor in the direction shown in the diagram onto the sunlight sensor rack. Place the solar panel on the single axis solar tracker. Take out 16 solar panel middle clamp and 16 M8 x 22 mm hex socket cap bolt. Installing and fixing solar panels. Installing the solar tracker controller onto the main pole using 2 M6 x 10 mm hex socket cap bolt.